Hey guys, it's Mary. Today's video is a May favorites video. I have been loving so many things for the month of May, so I decided to include a few of my favorites. If you are not following me on social media, you should totally do that. I will have my Instagram and my Twitter down below and if you are not subscribed already go and hit the subscribe button down below So you'll be notified every single time I post a video and without further ado Let's get on to the video my ultimate like number one favorite that I have been loving this month so freaking much is the Anastasia contour kit from Anastasia. It's the powder one. I want to get the cream one and I want to get a bunch more products from Anastasia because their products are freaking amazing. I want to get like their glow kit and some of their liquid lipsticks so bad but I'm like broke so. So this is what it looks like. There's um three contour shades and three highlight. Um, I mainly use the one in the middle because it's cool tone and it looks more natural on my skin. Um, sometimes I deepen it up with um, this one over here because it's still more on the cool tone side. Up here, I just like the highlight shade. So in the middle, it's like this banana powder color and it has no shimmer or anything. It's matte and I use that underneath on my triangle. I use it in like a triangle underneath here and below my contour just to make my contour stand out a lot more and clean up all the edges and everything and it looks really good and to set all my like makeup and whatnot. And then I mainly use this um, highlight for a highlighter when I'm not using like um, my MAC um, highlighter or like my NYX or whatnot, I'm using this one and sometimes I use this one as well. And the next item I have here is actually just my sculpting brush from Real Techniques that I use to contour with and you can get it from Ulta and it's per- oh my god, it's like amazing. It's like the perfect like density or whatever so it's perfect for like, I don't know, you don't want like something to like flimsy to be like contouring with it gives you like the perfect like strong contour that you can really blend out and everything and I absolutely love it. Now moving on to liquid lipsticks. Um I've been loving the NYX um liquid suede and lingerie lipsticks so they are these right here. I do have another shade of this one but I've been loving this one so much. This is the NYX liquid suede cream lipstick in the shade vintage the lingerie ones um just because they're more matte because the suede ones do have more of a cream finish because they are not completely matte um and here is the next lingerie one um i need to get so many more colors of this they are honestly one of my favorite liquid lipsticks i've ever used so far I am getting my Kylie Cosmetics liquid lipsticks in soon, so I'm not sure how well they compare to it. I've heard so many good things about the Kylie Cosmetics, um, but yeah, this is the next one right here, and I can't wait to try out the Kylie Cosmetics one, but so far, these are like my go-to, and if I like these so much more, I will be sticking with those. Of course, I'll use my Kylie ones because I spent like $80 on all the liquid lipsticks. Not all of them, but the ones that I bought, and I will definitely want to get use out of them, but... These are freaking amazing. I love them. Then I have my NYX HD blush in the shade Soft Spoken. And this is what it looks like. I use it more of as a highlight color, but this is what it looks like. It's very peachy, so I kind of use it sometimes as a blush and highlight in one. Two perfumes that I've absolutely been loving. I will show you them both. I have the Ariana Grande perfume that I'm almost out of. And a florally and girly um that's all i can really use to describe it but it smells really really good and i absolutely love it the chanel chance yeah i have chance by chanel but it's a sample size and chanel perfume is really expensive so i got the sample size first and now i'm going to be like trying it out and seeing if i like it but i absolutely love it and then the next beauty product i have which is my last beauty product is um i don't even know it's this trend starter i've never heard of this brand it's basically just this keratin leave-in product my hair got really damaged um and i had to cut a lot off it's not really that noticeable but um since my hair was so damaged you couldn't actually see like how long it was until like i straightened all of it and everything which i tried not to do at like before I got it cut because I didn't want it even more damaged but it was basically maybe down to here or so and then I got two inches three inches off and this has been amazing um keratin leave-in product or anything I would definitely get one now it makes your hair so smooth and soft and it definitely makes it like really healthy and nice looking um is a fashion favorite and it's this shirt hold on I think I wore it in like a couple of videos um but 
yeah, this is what it looks like. It's from Garage. Um, I think it's like a Canadian based store, but it sells, it sells where I am and it just started getting warm. Like it's been like 60 degrees for so long and then it like, I don't even know. May has been so not warm and then it just recently started getting like 80 degrees all of a sudden. So yeah, but I absolutely love this top. I wear it with like high waist stuff because it's kind of crop, but it's not like really cropped. It's like longer than a crop top but shorter than like a long top I guess you could say so it's like I wear it with like high-waisted stuff so you can't see my stomach or anything and I absolutely love it um it's kind of like a high neck spaghetti strap and I think I have that on in my daily makeup routine anyways I wear it all the time and I absolutely love it that's pretty much it for all of my favorites for May 2016 I hope you all enjoyed the video and if you did don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below and like I said earlier don't forget to follow me on Instagram I'll have all my links down below and I will see you in my next video bye guys <laughs>